Hello YouTube, Robert Alvarez, the Psychic Witch, also known as Mr. Lighting on a Fan. Good evening to all of you in YouTube land. So I wanted to give you some newsletter updates. As you may recall, and I will link the video um, where I talked about the newsletters that I'm offering. As you may recall, um, I'm offering different newsletters. They're free of charge. Um, I enjoy writing them. I enjoy sharing them. So one of the newsletters is called Prosperous Minds, um, and it's all about financial prosperity and health and well-being and abundance and wealth and opulence. There is the Divine Love Healing newsletter, and of course there's my, one of my personal favorites, the Witch Bitch newsletter. Um, so there are different newsletters that I've started. Most of them began because of a particular metaphysical class that I used to offer. As most of you know, I have no. I have. I stopped offering metaphysical classes a few years ago. Um, I want to say that um, technically, I stopped offering metaphysical classes in February of 2020. But officially, I stopped offering them in June of 2021. I don't miss them. Uh, they were enjoyable for the time being, but I stopped enjoying them and it didn't make sense to continue to offer metaphysical classes, group or private, in person or online, if they no longer excited me, if they no longer brought me joy, if they no longer were fun for me, and if they were no longer prosperous for me. So I stopped offering them. I don't miss them at all. Um, but I did want to continue offering my newsletter. So um, I haven't written a new one yet. Uh, quite frankly, uh, since my sabbatical ended, I've been uh, speaking with people who want to schedule appointments with me. I've been preparing for the upcoming events that I'm doing in October and November. Technically, I am doing an event in December, but that has not been official yet. Um, I'm tentative slash definite going to be at that event in December of 2023, but official, it is not yet official. So in the meantime, so all of this has been on my mind, and then of course, you know, resuming my YouTube videos and all this other stuff. So what's going to happen now, going forward, is that I'm going to create a blog post for the newsletter. For example, let's say with the Prosperous Minds um, newsletter issues, I will write a blog post on my professional, metaphysically oriented WordPress blog, which is called This Is Who I Am, and it'll be like Prosperous Minds colon space crystals for, pros crystals for prosperity, something like that. And then in the body of the blog post, I will also include um, images of those crystals using the same example. There will be an accompanying YouTube video, um, and I will uh, ideally have actual live specimens of those crystals. And then, of course, I will have in the body of the blog post a tiny URL. Now, I must admit, even after all these years, I do not remember offhand what the letters U, R, and L stand for, but a URL is essentially a, a web link a link to a website address. A tiny URL is a condensed version of that particular um, website link. So let's say, for example, you know, like, um, let's say that I have a blog post and all together between the date and the title, um, it has a combination of, let's say, 27 characters. Whereas I create a tiny URL and it'll have maybe six characters. So the body of that um, blog post will contain the tiny URL, and of course the, any other links will be included in the blog post, but then the tiny URL will also make it more easily shareable. And somebody who actually uh, receives all of my newsletters had made this suggestion to me. She didn't actually directly make it, but she mentioned how she found it difficult to share links to my newsletter issues via a text message. So I'm like, you know what, I can adapt. 
So that's one change that's going to take place. So, and I did, of course, since there are people that receive these blog, these newsletters primarily via email, I informed them first. But now, going forward, it's going to be um, a blog post. The body of the blog post will have the tiny URL, um, the accompanying YouTube video, which may or may not always be the case, because sometimes I create YouTube videos that do not have an accompanying blog post, and sometimes I create a blog post that doesn't have an accompanying YouTube video. So sometimes there are two, sometimes there's just one each. That's how it is. So there will come a time when there will be a combination of the two, um, but most of the time there won't be. And the particular focus will be the first part. So if it's a Prosperous Minds blog post, it will begin with Prosperous Minds. If it is uh, a Divine Love Healing blog post, then it will begin with Divine Love Healing. And then, of course, the Witch Bitch newsletter, which will have... Um, you know, the Witch Bitch newsletter is still a work in progress. It's still like, because I don't want it to be just about magic and witchcraft. Sometimes I want to focus on a particular goddess, or I want to focus on um, a specific um, plant that can be used for magical purposes, or a resource like a book, or a website, or a store, or what have you. So I don't want it to just be about one specific thing. I wanted to encompass a variety of things. And I do know that one of the things that I have planned for the Witch Bitch newsletter is highlighting different types of magical paths. Because as most of you know, as well, I don't want to assume that, as some of you may know, there are different kinds of magical paths. There's Gardnerian Wicca, there's Alexandrian Wicca, there's Dianic Feminist Wicca, there is um, Hellenism, the, the magic of the ancient Greeks, and of course there's the, the magic of the ancient Egyptians. Neat, um, Heka is the ancient Egyptian word for magic, and no, it is not lost on me that Heka is the beginning of Hecate. That's an, that's, it, I could really go off on a tangent, but as I would say, it is another topic for another video for another day. But, um, so, but of course, all of you can still receive the email newslet the newsletters via email. Just send me an email. I will include my email address in the description box, and you can let me know which one you want. The linked video that lists all my different newsletters will be in the description box as well, so you can go through. And there are some people that receive all of them, and there are some people that they only want to receive the one for Prosperous Minds. Some people only want to receive the ones on Divine Love Healing Energy. Some people, they're like, I only want the Witch Bitch newsletter. And some of them receive all of my newsletters. So you have options, as I am so fond of saying, you have many options. I wish all of you a beautiful night, a wonderful weekend. I want to thank all of you who already received my newsletters, who have already subscribed to my newsletters. I want to thank those of you who have been spreading the word about my newsletters. And I also want to thank those of you who have given me feedback about the newsletters you've received, because that helps me improve my writing with these newslet newsletters. And of course, thank you to all of you in YouTube land for all the likes, all the comments, all the shares and all the subscriptions, and an extra big and beautiful and bountiful thank you, um, or an extra beautiful and big and bountiful thank you to those of you who have already scheduled your sessions. I wish all of you an amazing evening, a beautiful weekend. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay hydrated, stay empowered, and stay tuned for the next video.